Okay, I'm back. I got everything unpackaged. I um, actually have a little bit of a surprise because um, I forgot that I had ordered something from Walmart that Premier delivers because Premier is one of the Walmart sellers. Walmart has sellers like Amazon has sellers and Premier Yarns. Hirschner's is also one of them. So um, if you are one of the people like me, I no longer drive. I don't have a license to drive anymore. Walmart Plus is a godsend. I mean, for like 13 something a month, not only do I get free deliveries from the store, someone drives things over for me, but I get free shipping. I could spend buy something that's a dollar and they'll ship it for free. Or I can, everybody over $35 gets free shipping at walmart.com. Doesn't, you don't have to have an account or anything. You could even be um, incognito. You don't have to sign up or anything um but under 35 dollars you have to be a walmart plus member and i'm not toting walmart plus or toting walmart i i don't um there's other than yarn companies which i love them all i don't discriminate i love yarn companies period um, I really don't care about other stores. I do not like name brands. I'm not a name brand person. Could care less about tags and all that junk that a lot of Americans are heavily into. Don't care. <laughs> me, economical all the way. So, you know, Walmart kind of fits me in that respect. And also, they they are a godsend to me because they deliver uh, my groceries. I get my groceries from the local delivered from the local grocery store as well, but I always get from Walmart. Um, we don't have huge WalMarts here in Connecticut. I'm in Connecticut, and Connecticut's tiny. Uh, the WalMarts here are actually WalMarts from all the depart that are up from all the department stores that were here in yesteryear in the the 80s and 90s, uh, Ames and Kmart and Caldor and Bradley's and all those old ones that uh, don't exist anymore. Walmart and Target, of course, bought out all those stores up in this area. And most of them are not large. Um, not like when I lived, I did live in Georgia and the Walmarts there are humongous, like uh, their malls. Like the mall, <laughs> they're pretty much the size of the mall here. So, anyways, um, Walmart Plus, you get uh, not only do you get free delivery and free shipping all the time, you get free access to special deals, you get a savings plan with coupons that gives you extra money, and you get uh, what is the name of that? Uh, it's it's a they make movies not not peacock that one i get from the cable company um paramount paramount uh app for your tv or whatever you watch television on that's free with your walmart plus account so that's 9.99 9.99 a month anyway so for a couple extra dollars more you know, so even if you use the Paramount and you get one delivery or um, one shipping, which is five ninety nine, I believe their shipping is, um, right there, you've already earned, you know, got your money from. So enough about Walmart. Let's talk about yarn because that's what we're here for. That's all we care about is yarn, <laughs> yarn, yarn. Okay, so I, I ordered, um, I was watching Cinnamon Stitches, and I'll link her down below the other day, um, and she she does, she's an affiliate with Premier. I am not, I love Premier, but I not, am not affiliated, I don't even have any subscribers yet, so I'm not affiliated with anybody, any yarn company, everything I say is my opinion, um, and honestly, what your opinion is of that keep it to yourself because I don't care. Um, I only care what God thinks of me. <laughs> so, 
<laughs> if you don't like what I say, you don't have to watch it. It's the way I look at things. Um, but anyways, I got this wonderful spun colors. When I saw it on Cinnamon Stitch's channel, I've seen this around. It, this, it wasn't like it was new when the first time I've seen it was on her channel. I've seen it, but I just totally like it was in the back of my mind. And when I saw the cowl she made with it, I was like, oh my God, I have got to have this. So I bought one. I said, I want to try it first. They are $9.99 each. Um, there's no, I think I got it for $9.29. I don't know. There's really not, they're $9.29 on, at Walmart and they're $9.99 on Premier. Um, which I will get mo if I like crocheting with it and it doesn't, uh, there's some yarns that just don't feel right on my skin. So if, and so far <laughs> I'm sitting here loving on this and it is super, super soft. Anyway, I'll give you the, the, the scoop of what's, what's going on with this yarn. Um, this is 65% acrylic, 35% fine superwash mer merino a.k.a. super soft. Um, it's a medium weight four. Uh, the knitting needles, they recommend a five millimeter US eight. Um, and for crochet hooks, they recommend a five millimeter US H8. Um, hand wash, lay flat to dry. This is in the colorway Twilight, and it was made in Turkey by Premier Yarns, who are located in Harrisburg, North Carolina. And Twilight is this color. I, all the colorways are beautiful. It was hard to choose, but I just fell in love with this Twilight. And um, as soon as I try it out, if I like it, it does look a little bit pilly. So we will see, you know, I mean, obviously it's got Superwash Merino in it. I'm going to... Uh, oh, here's an extra piece. I am going to definitely um, hand wash and uh, lay flat to dry. Um, but it is super soft. As Crystal at Bag -a Day Crochet says, it is scarfable. No doubt. I would wear this baby. I would sleep with this baby every day. So I will... Um, uh crochet up a swatch like crochet from with tiffany hansen tells us to do we should do the swatch crochet up a swatch see if i like it um and let you guys know so that was a, the um you have to forgive me i have brain fog constantly because of fibromyalgia and god only knows what else hit my head so many times that's premier spun colors so there's that and so far only four, I think I've all together, I ordered yikes, 18 bobbins, um, but only four came today. So, and uh, I did not know these were this big. I mean, I don't even feel like it fits in my camera. Yeah, I guess it does, but they're huge. So the storing these, I mean, they are going to be able to sit on top of each other. So I guess that's okay on the shelf, but... You know, they were going to take up quite a bit of room, and that might have been one of the reasons they weren't very popular. But, you know, this is the anti-pilling yarn. It is super, super duper soft. I've crocheted with this yarn. It is so easy to work with. Love it. Love it. One of my very, very favorite yarns. <laughs> and it comes in a good deal of different colors if you want to buy the skeins. And I can't remember... I mean, I got 18, no, I got nine different colors. I want to say there was something like a dozen different, 16, 12, 16 different colors. I can't remember. Because I know there were a few I didn't get. I did not get any of the blacks or whites because I keep those colors on hand in different types of yarn all the time, especially acrylics. So anyways, the Premier Anti-Pilling Everyday Bobbin are three balls in one, endless possibilities. Um, it is a medium weight four, 100% anti-pilling acrylic. Uh, there is a patent pending on it. This is in the colorway Periwinkle. 
which I really, really, really love. It's a, it's like an in-between light blue and light purple. One of my favorite colors. So like I said, each color has 181 yards or three ounces each, 166 meters, 85 grams. For a total of 543 yards, 498 meters or nine ounces, 255 grams. Um, it is, uh, where is it made? I'm pretty sure it's Turkey, but I will see if I can verify that. Of course, it's Ocotex. What is this? Premier Yarn, Sarah Spurred, Four Premier, Sarah Spurred, no. It just says distributed by Premier Yarns. Yep, made in Turkey. I was right. So this is the Periwinkle. I don't know if you can see that. And what other ones did I get? Oh, okay. There's still some of them are. I just took, I had taken just the Periwinkle out of the plastic. I'm going to take them out of the plastic anyways because I keep them in um, organza bags. And this colorway is Blue Moon, which, because I'm new, my favorite color is blue. Now, um, I don't always wear blue because other than a very, very light blue, I, um, if my glasses are blue, I, uh, it's not really doesn't look all that great on me I've been told you know like silvers and pinks and sandy beach and shell colors if I wear blue it's got to be very pastel -y, you know very light blue oh I love this this one is called tulip wood I wish they told you what each is so they even give you a picture of what it crochets up like in a sweater and that is pretty cool. This is the tulip wood. Let me put that over there. Here is the um, blue moon in a sweater. Oops. It's pretty cool. And the periwinkle in a sweater. Oops. So that's, you know, if you... Uh, If you uh, did a, want to use the whole bobbin, but what's nice about this is, is if that, if you don't want to, you don't have to, you can just use it like it's a skein. And if the bobbins are a pain in the butt, so what? Take them up. <laughs> Let's not make a, you know, I, I just thought it was kind of silly. I think for me, I, the reason why I had never tried it is it, they charge more because, you know, like the Ogo when it came out where it was more money, it was cheaper to buy the skein than, you know, than the Ogo. It was that kind of deal. You know, I believe, you know, I don't remember what they charged the regular price was. I'd have to look on the premier site. But um, if it was more than $15, then, then, then that was too much. And I want to say that it was 16, but I, I don't quote me on that. This one's a little bit on the messed up side. So, oh, it fixes really quick though. Okay. So in any event, um, this colorway is, do, 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 sand dollar. See, now if I wear browns, it's got to be little, you know, light, light, even lighter than this one. These two would be fine. The the really light. It almost looks white on my cheap phone, but it isn't. It's it's it is you know, and I don't have great lighting. Um, I'm just new to doing this. It is uh, a very very light beige, and the colors that are um, speckled are just the two other colors together. So that is my um, bobbin yarn so far. Now with Rose, um, 
so adorable. Of course, everything was in purple. That is her color for those of you that know Rose. And I got a little uh, fish in a bag. Um, I used to be a pet store manager before I had my kids. That was like, I don't know, 35 years ago. Um, and I grew up, my dad taught me how to raise and breed and we showed tropical fish. So we had a lot of aquariums. I had vast knowledge, which a lot of it I've forgotten on aquarium keeping and breeding and showing and different uh, things about tropical fish. And, you know, that was that. So in any event, I got that. I already opened it because I had to. I wanted to see her stitch markers and how they worked because I make my own stitch markers myself and I just wanted to see hers. And I, and I've seen that, that, that um, particular, uh, fish in a bag at Joanne's, I think. Michael's or Joanne's, one of them. But I also, and it and it did come apart, and it's not her fault. It's it's the male. Um, it, this is just she got the clearance yarn for a dollar seven at Hobby Lobby. I because I don't drive. There there may be buses to my Hobby Lobby, but in all honesty. It would, it, it's just not worth my while. If I order something from, if I needed something in from Hobby Lobby, I would, I would order it online. It really would be that difficult to get there that it would be worth paying them the shipping if I really, so I, I honestly hardly rarely get Hobby Lobby um, yarns because of that. And when I went to visit my daughter in Georgia, it was the off week. They weren't 30% off. So I wasn't buying anything. All right. So anyways, this is just three little things. Because like I said, I just wanted to support her channel. She doesn't normally sell yarn, but she's like de-stashing. And so this um, were like little three little skeins that came together and you know, it, she charged a dollar fifty, which for me was much cheaper than you know what I would have paid for it anyway. So yeah, it was well worth it. It was worth paying it. Um, I wish I could donate more to her. She is just a lovely, lovely lady, and I enjoy her very much. But in any event, I will tell you about the yarn. It is very super soft. It's definitely scarfable. It's shiny too. It has a nice shine to it. I uh, there's a, whoops yellow and there's like a pinky color and the green and the reason this is called tulip sweet minis tulip tails so it's the color of tulips and let's see there are 4.2 ounces 300 yards and let's see it use a four mil film uh, four millimeter knitting needle size six USA UK size eight or five millimeter crochet hook size um, H eight USA or size six uh, UK and like I said the color name uh, way is tulip tails and this is by yarn B out of Oklahoma and it is made in China. So that right now concludes my haul. I think I've talked enough. I can talk about yarn forever and ever. I talked to my dog. He knows more about yarn than any dog in the world, I think. So <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed my little presentation. And um, I want everybody to stay safe. Take care. God bless and keep those hooks and needles going. Bye all.